Hey guys, welcome back. Today we got a treat for you for Behind That Fence is a beautiful swimming pool that we are tearing out. Now everybody wants to know why. Well, this one's got a crack in that corner, got a busted skimmer, several leaks. Uh, the rock work needs to be redone. It needs to be replastered. Just a huge expense for a pool that's just not getting used much. So the homeowner decided, time to go. Special thanks to 57 Services, Blake Boyd, for helping us out with this. He and his guys did a fabulous job of removing this swimming pool. Day two, and as you can see, they got uh, most of the pool demolished on that first day. All the pool, the bottom is broken up. The big step and retaining wall here uh, is now gone. If you look up at the near the house, so you can see the plywood, and all that is to protect the windows. When you start smashing these rocks, that stuff goes everywhere. Okay, here we are at the end of day two. Lower deck patio's been all pulled up. Now this wall, this wall is gonna remain. Beginning to backfill out of the rock. Moving into day four, all of the backfill is complete, so now we're just adding topsoil and uh, getting it prepared for the grass that'll go in there. I think we he brought in six or eight loads of uh, fill and topsoil to uh, complete this project. So just about finishing up on all the machine work. Moving into day five, the concrete uh, team shows up and they removed the rest of the hot tub. I had to do that by hand. It was just too close to the windows, didn't want to knock anything out or tear down this wall. And they made quick work of it. By the end of the day, they had the concrete poured, uh, troweled out, and it looked really good. Next was the sprinkler guys. They showed up, put in the new sprinkler system, and planted some shrubs around the wall uh, to finish things up. Then the towel guy was next. He came in and repaired the wall give it a nice finished look and uh, in a few weeks we'll have grass and we'll be, this job will be complete thanks for watching you guys hope to catch you on the next one